Hello and welcome. This video is brought to you by the streamingadvisor.com. Tailor your entertainment with streaming. What we're going to do today is take a look at how to remove apps from a Gbox queue. This is a question I got from a viewer and I thought that it was a really great question. And so I decided to make this video just to show my subscriber and everybody else how to do that issue. So here's what you do. You go into settings and you go into the settings menu here. You press OK and it brings you back to the basic Android settings. And what you do is select this little orange gear here, other, and press down to where it says more settings. Select OK, and what this does is it brings you into your actual Android settings, the whole backbone of the G-Box and every other Android-based device. You want to toggle down to where it says apps and press OK. And here are all the actual installed apps. Yeah, you know, basically the same way you'd see on a phone or something like that. And you're going to remove something. And what we're going to remove here is the Sling TV app because Sling TV doesn't actually work on a G Box anymore. So we select it, and you see we have force stop, uninstall, clear data, and so on. And we're going to uninstall it. You say OK, you do want to install uninstall it. And now it's been uninstalled. Uninstall is finished. So now if we back on back out and say look for it, like let's say we go to edit rows, you will no longer see Sling TV as an option on the list. And that is how you delete apps from the Gbox queue. If anybody else has any other questions about the Gbox or any of the number of streaming devices that we've shown you on our videos, let me know and I'll help you figure out how this stuff works. That's what we do. Thanks for watching. I'm Ryan Downey, the Streaming Advisor. Stream on, my friends.